Okay. This is a little breakfast we have in this morning. We have some buttered toast and Lauren has dry toast. Sausage links, cheesy eggs, cheesy scrambled eggs. We have grits that are flavored with uh, chicken bouillon and we're gonna have some cheese in it. All right, y'all, let's get ready to gather around so we can say the grace before I start serving. If we're having um, if we're having grits, we're not having pancakes. So which one you want? One or the other? Grits. Pancakes. One or the other? Grits. Grits. Lauren, is some frozen waffles in the freezer. Eat those. Cooking crazy. <laughs> which one? Grits. Yes. Kylie. Grits. Tamaya. Okay, then the grits have it. Lauren, you're gonna be eating uh, frozen waffles. And we're gonna eat the leftover sausages from last night and uh, cheesy eggs. Yay! Yay! Okay. Okay, we had a little get together over here last night and this is the wine and beer cart. Let's see what they left in here. Oh, they left some wine, we gotta get rid of that one because that was nasty. This is um, some Moscato. I didn't like it at all. Never had that before. It was nasty to me. So we're gonna throw it away. Then we have some Arbor Mist Peach Moscato. That's good because the top is still on it. And we have that Arbor Mist White Zinfandel Exotic Fruits. We'll save all this for Thanksgiving. Yep and some blackberry marlowe from Arbor Mist. Okay, I have to work every weekend until the week, the weekend after Thanksgiving. So we'll probably do something else and hopefully I can get all my sisters over here. Last night it was just two of my sisters and my mom. Oh, let me show you this beer. Yeah, we got a lot of beer left in there. So I'll probably take that upstairs and put that in Munch's man cave. And we did open a fit mascara. Get our water ready for the grits. That's eight cups. That's a um, my pot has the measuring scale on the inside. That's the Cuisinart. That's what I love about so much. All right, what we're gonna do is go ahead and let this come to a boil. And then we're gonna add our chicken broth. And then we're gonna add two cups of quick grits. That's what we're gonna be using right here. Two cups. Okie dokie. Water ready. We're gonna add the bouillon. This is gonna be like two heaping spoonfuls of chicken flavor bouillon. You can use any brand that you want to. I like to get this right here from Noor because it's a big container and it lasts for a long time until the girls put in their noodles. All right, I'm gonna put two cups of grits. I said two and a half, but I'm gonna wait until they cook some and come back and see if I need to add any more. So let's get it stirred a little bit. We're gonna stir it for about a minute. Then we're gonna turn it down and walk off. Cause you know with grits, boy, you don't wanna get them things popping on you. Cause that's a bad burn. So I usually stir it for about a minute, maybe two, just to get past that stage where it's kind of sticky. It's about like pasta. Turn it down. This is my quick boil eye. 
And once I get them to a certain point, I'm gonna take them to the back of the eye of the stove. And that way I won't have to worry about them on low. Okay, so got them turned down to about two. We're gonna put the top back on. Crick it so it won't close all the way and I won't have no spillage or no overflow. Now comes the tricky part. What we're gonna do, since we popping going on, just take it off the eye and stir it. Okay, that's good. They've been cooking for about five minutes. What we're gonna do now, because they're good, we're gonna take them and we're gonna put them on the back eye and just let them continue to boil, to cook, just so they can get creamy, okay? And then we're gonna cook the rest of our breakfast. How many of us is it here today? Just five? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna make the toast. So what now? Huh? What? Let's see. Yeah, put it on. Don't put it on there for you. Okay. over there on the stove until I get ready to cook it. But right now I'm gonna get the eggs ready. So, I don't know how these guys eat eggs, but they love cheese eggs, okay, and cheese grits. So in the morning time, whenever I cook breakfast on the weekends, they love cheesy eggs. So I just scramble them and I add the cheese to them when they're almost done. And these are jumbo eggs great value jumbo eggs that I get from Walmart. Oh, y'all. And sometimes I like to get these and catch a double yolk. Okay, so I'm going to cook about 10. Oh, look at that. I talked it up. Look at that double yolk. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, sometimes when they're a little pointed like that, let's see if I can find another one. I usually can spot them out when I open them up. So either they're gonna have a really big yolk or they're gonna have a double yolk. This one might have a double yolk right here because it's pretty big. Stuck to the darn carton too. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see get it. I hate this. I really do not like when they are stuck like that. But that's the biggest one in the carton look like. Well, look, look at this one too. That's double. Okay, so let's take that out. That was a double too. So you can tell when they're big, they gotta be a double. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Let's just do eight because we got some doubles in there. 
And I wanna make sure they eat the eggs, not waste them. Let me get these eggs, put them in this bowl, and I'm gonna put them in the refrigerator because I didn't wanna put them back in that carton that I had poured. Okay, now for my um, scrambled eggs, I only put salt and pepper in them because garlic makes them nasty. I hate garlic in eggs. I've never liked that. And uh, it make them taste like rubber or something. To me, it just feel like it's foaming up in my mouth. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of whole milk. That's good. And then I'm just gonna whisk these, get them mixed together. Who was that in here? Give me some butter out the refrigerator so I can put it in this pan. Go ahead and get this eye started. Go ahead and warm my eye up. Stick butter. Okay. So I'm gonna let the um, pan get warm and then I'm gonna cook these eggs and I'm getting ready to take the sausage out the oven too because it's good. It's ready. Just needs to be heated through. Oh, look at them big sausages. Now them things on swole. That's what we was eating last night. I think we got different kinds because we didn't know what would make a good sausage dog. And to be honest, these right here, they were a little too big for our buns, but and they were spicy, okay? I can't remember the kind, the name of them or anything, but these are left over. The kids are probably not gonna eat the spicy ones, so they'll probably eat those, okay? All right, let's go head back over to this eye. Now, while I'm cooking my toast, I'm gonna have the um, oven crack like that, so I'm gonna be moving back and forth. I cook it on broil. Honey, come on with it. Thank you. That's Lauren here. Okay, can you find them? It's about to put them eggs in the refrigerator, please. Thank you, dog. What are y'all doing? What are you doing? Okay, Tamaya and um, Kylie, go in the closet and get some plates. And um, get some plates and put them on the table, please. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put these eggs in here. The toast smell good in the oven too. Now if you're gonna cook your toast on broil, Always leave it cracked a little bit because you don't want them to burn. All right, let me move it back a little bit so I can check it. And I'm gonna flip it over. Lauren doesn't like uh, butter on her toast. So we have two pieces with nothing on it. That's good, it's fine. Do me a favor, get the jelly out the refrigerator. I got the butter, um, go on the drawer, oh no, go on the table in there where we ate last night and get some forks. Get the couple forks and put them in here on the table in the dining room. Okay, just leave them there. You put the tape, the, um, that's where you put the plates? You can. I'm gonna eat in there with y'all too. Strawberry jelly, it's some grape in there too. Kylie, get me another plate for the toast. Thank you, sweetie. What'd you say? Okay, that's mean y'all put it back in there sticky. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put some cheese in here. Go ahead and get this toast out. Okay, dokie.
I should make some basic videos for scrambled eggs and stuff like that because a lot of people are just starting out in the kitchen and may not know how to cook certain things. So I think that'll be good on how to start cooking. Come and get this cheese and put it in there on the table for the grits. And I'm gonna be in there and bring everything in there to me. Y'all set me a place? Where am I gonna sit? Put that in there, thank you. Okay, we're gonna take it off the eye so it won't get rubber. I won't turn rubber. And that's what the eggs look like. Good cheesy eggs.
You want ice with your orange juice? Yeah. How do you hold it?
cooking corn, vegetables with the cornbread. And we're gonna make some candy apples. Mm -hmm. I think you're dressed. I'm dressed. For today?
to ride your bike with, and you got the little pads, little gloves, and knee pads. Yeah, so someone has to have